everyone. Uh, so for those of you listening in on my live, this is live on TikTok at the moment. Uh, for those of you that are going to be watching this later on YouTube, hello, my name is Ken. Uh, I do fitness stuff, specifically CrossFit, um, otherwise known as Mixed Modal, the actual word of Mixed Modal, not just CrossFit. Uh, for those of you who don't know who, what Mixed Modal is, think of it kind of like how CrossFit is everything, and then Mixed Modal is everything plus CrossFit, because CrossFit training is different from mixed modal. Just the methodology completely different, but it does include CrossFit training. So a little bit different, not a lot of people know that, uh, but I do compete in CrossFit competitions. I haven't done very well thus far. I'm really only on year three of my CrossFit uh, journey as of right now. So still looking to uh, hit that peak level of uh, competition. Haven't quite got there yet. Uh, for those of you who don't know, my channel is fairly new. I'm not looking for funding. I'm not looking for uh, a whole lot of income off of this. I'm just here to put educational type fitness stuff out there. So uh, for those of you who want to learn more about fitness, maybe more about different training methodologies, hit me up. Uh, message me on my Instagram. That would be the best way to get a hold of me, honestly. Uh, today I'm starting off with some warm up and then five rounds for time, uh, 250 meter row plus five burpees, and then I'm going to hop on the bike for calories. Uh, the calories are going to match what the calories I did for the 250-meter row. So typically that takes me about 55 seconds to do 250 meters on the rower. Um, in those 55 seconds, however many calories I burn on the rower, that's what I'm going to equal to on the bike. And then five burpees after that, and that's one round. So five of that for time. Uh, and then I'm going to rest a little bit and then I'm going to put 10 minutes on the clock. I'm going to do a super set of one burpee, one box jump, one pull up. And that those three combined is going to be one whole rep. Um, so that's just what I'm going to do today. And like I said, you will see this later on YouTube. Uh, but for now we are here and that is not good lighting at all. My goodness. Let's try that. Well, that's awful too. Anyway. I'm really not very good at this. I don't even know why anybody's watching. Well, that didn't go well. Yeah. 
Anyway, so as you can see, I've not practiced this whatsoever. Like, not even a tiny bit. I should also mention, I'm not going to edit or cut this. This is just raw footage. You're welcome. Still very close to How about now? You can see the seat of the bike. Apologies for that. I'm going to start my warm up now. Very important to focus on loosening up the shoulders. Notice my hands. I don't think I can notice because that light. So bad, and I'm not sorry still.
Sorry about that. Forgot to turn my thermostat down. So I've been sucking in the cold air. That's not fun.
here's my essay. And I'm going to click through Grammarly suggestions in the right hand. What idea was this?
Last one, come on. All right. Instant regret. No oxygen. In brain. Can't make number words. I should have started with excuses. Like Demolition Ranch. Shout out, Demolition Ranch. I love you. Should have made my excuses before I started. I am convinced the assault bike is out to murder everyone. That sucks.
Alright, let's look at how we did. <laughs> Name a car for an edit. 1969. 1969 Dodge Charger generally style. <sighs> Hands down, also my favorite car. Anyway. <sighs> okay, so. Let's go over that again. Five rounds for time, 250 meter row, five burpees. And then on the bike calories, I have to match what I did on the row during those 250 meters. So first round, I did 18 calories. Went out way too hot in that. Second, third, and fourth round, I did 16. And I definitely slowed down in the last one. I did 15 calories. And then I finished with five burpees. So 17.37 for that. Whew. I'm going to rest up a little bit. And then I've got my superset. And my bonus day. I wish I could say I was done, but I'm not. Let's see. Let's just move through this. What's up? Did who go? If you hang around, there's another part to my workout. It's going to be as entertaining as the last part. That's a lie. Neither of them are entertaining. And if you believe that, well, oh, sorry. Okay, I had a bit of a situation with my phone, so that's annoying. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's fine. Everything's going to be fine. Is it possible to survive a heart attack after having a heart attack for multiple minutes in a row? Because that's what it feels like. Also, I would like to point out, way too many people think that what I just did is cardio. It's not cardio. It's glycolytic. There's a difference. Aerobic and glycolytic are two different things. I know a friend of mine, Catherine, told her she was doing this. Anyway, she does, she does cross-fit. Anyway, right here. Uh, but she does, you know, quote-unquote cross-fit. But she refuses to go running with me. I don't know what it is. I guess I'm just having fun with
And before you ask, this is the 20 inch side of the box. And I'll explain why. Because when I go up here, oh, hold on. Let me just break this. Because when I go up here, that's me on the 20 inch side of the box. So there's a 20 inch side, a 24 inch side, and a 30 inch side. I have to do my box jumps on the, the 20 inch side because my ceilings are too low. So that's frustrating. But oh well. It is what it is. Grammarly does more than catch errors. With Grammarly, you can find really good, no, perfect words that make your writing sharp or explicit or excellent or distinctive. As a matter of fact, for what it's worth, Grammarly can. Yeah, that's long. We can get rid of that. Gotta figure out where to put my phone now. I will get better at this, but right now it is what it is. I refuse to edit videos. <laughs> it's supposed to sound like that. Almost got it. Almost got it. Oh. 
Okay. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. So. That's my first. All right. For those of you who were not here a little bit ago when I did the first part of my workout before I rest, um, we're going to do a superset. 10 minutes on the clock, one burpee, one box jump, one pull. That's one rep. Okay? Those three things all together, one rep. And that's going to go for 10 minutes, and we're going to go for as many reps as possible. So whatever reps I end up getting, times it by three as total. But really, we're just going for a total super sense. I'm going to restart this part of the music because it's my favorite part. Um...
Oh, cheese crackers and walnuts. Cheese whiz in the ear. And all seven oceans. Okay. I'm just gonna sum up really quick and then I'll be heading out because I got a shower because I'm stinky. Stinky butt. My stinky butt brings all the girls to the yard. Anyway. So five rounds for time. 1737. Rested. And then got 43 plus my box jump in my supersets in 10 minutes. Not bad. Anyway, guys. So that all that um, revolves revolves around glycolytic, which is supposed to be repeatable over uh, a certain amount of time. Like you should be able to rest after and then do it again essentially. Um, a lot of people think that's aerobic, which a lot of people think is cardio. It's not. It's different. Two different uh, types of energy used. So I I probably got into, let's see, I probably didn't touch any of my fat stores, and I doubt I touched any of my protein energy. So what that means is 
when you only go so far into the type of energy you use. Um, like I burned a lot of calories, but uh, not a whole lot of fat. But since I repeated the glycolytic, I was able to deep, dive deep into my muscular endurance. And what that does is it makes your body hungry. Like your body needs quick energy. So uh, simple carbs, uh, like your sugars, um, your simple sugars, fruit, stuff like that, um, bread, simple carbs. Like I burned a lot of that. So when I get up to eat here after my shower, I'm going to be eating rice, rice, uh, some sausage, and uh, some uh, some fruit, uh, most likely apples. So I got simple carbs, a lot of simple carbs. I got some uh, some protein, not a lot. Um, I'll supplement that with a protein shake. Uh, but yeah, uh, didn't really dive deep into my fat, fats, energy, or my protein energies. So simple carbs will replace all that. That's all, really all you need to know. Um, if you're looking to lose weight, those are good workouts for you to do because um, they burn off the uh, the simple carbs, like the simple, like they're just gone. Um, if you're looking to burn fat, you need to do more um, lower intensity muscular endurance. And what that'll do is it'll build lean muscle and then the lean muscle build burns fat. Um, you don't have to do cardio to lose weight. You can do cardio to lose weight. A lot of people will tell you, don't you don't do cardio. You can't do cardio. You just make yourself fat. That's not true. It's not true. Cardio does not make you fat. Um, there is a certain chemical released into your muscles when you do um, muscle specific weight training. And it's what builds lean muscle and that's what burns fat. Um, that chemical is not released during cardio. The way cardio helps you lose fat is um, it burns calories, and it puts you. It can put you into a calorie deficit, which if you're burning more calories than you're taking in, you will lose weight. But what that's actually doing is it's burning your fat stores because your body has no quick energy, so it has to go deeper into its like protein and fat stores. So just a little. Uh, knowledge for you guys. It's totally free. Like I'm just here. Ask me questions. Um, I, I don't characterize myself as an expert, but I have a decent, decent knowledge base. I've been doing the, I've been doing fitness since I was 12 and I've been specifically doing mixed modal CrossFit training, uh, since I was 26. So, uh, I do have my own coach. She is way more knowledgeable than me and in way better shape, which is really unfair, but whatever. So anything that I say here, I do double check with her as well. Um, feel free to challenge me on anything that I said. If you feel it's wrong, please correct me. Like I said, I'm not doing this for money. I just want to get some information out there and hopefully be a knowledge base that people come to for just questions, questions and answered. That's what I'm here for. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. I did not. So there's that. Again, this will be unedited and it will be on my YouTube channel. Um, I will add my YouTube channel on here at some point, but for those watching on TikTok, um, just uh, search Arnold Fitness, and then my name is Ken Arnold. I have very few subscribers, so that was probably me, if you think it's me. Y'all have a good night.